Hello, Sam from Sound on Sound magazine here. I'm at the NAM show in Anaheim, California, and I'm with Philip from Austrian Audio. Hello, Philip. How are you doing? Hi, I'm fine. Thank you very much. It's a pleasure. Well, it's always uh, good to come by your stand. You make some very fine large diaphragm capacitor microphones. <coughs> As of now, you also make headphones. Yes, we do, and that's also part of our history and where we're coming from. Uh, but we feel that we have something else to offer to the industry. And so we have the Hi X55 here. That's an over-ear close-back headphones for professional studio applications. And yeah, we just didn't want to do just another headphone, but we wanted to bring in something new. And what we did is we developed a new capsule for this headphone. So we did a membrane, a, a new membrane form, a new magnet system. So the whole driver is an Austrian audio development by our engineers. We even use an Austrian made membrane. So we really try to focus on the materials and the things that we do. Um, we have a ring magnet system that was a very strong magnet. It has huge advantages because it lets the air easier pass inside of the driver and you can damp this in a more accurate way. And why do we need that? That is basically because we can stand higher signals and um, more rough signals. And that's what, uh, what were our findings when we looked into what people need for modern music production. What do we all do? We use a di all digital signal chain now. We use digital signals from the very beginning of our mix to the very end. At the very end, we're going to compress it because it needs to play in the kitchen radio. But over the whole mix process, we use uncompressed signals. And those signals tend to have much more um, uh, impedance uh, signals in there, uh, much more uh, loud signals, quiet signals at the very same time. Uh, and to really transmit that, you need a very good drive and a very good headphone. So this is about increasing the dynamic range of the headphones. Exactly, exactly, yeah. That's what where was our intention. And also to uh, improve the close back system on this headphone, we have given it a double housing, so the driver itself is closed already. Then we have the housing, so this is almost a noise cancelling headphone. It's not really cancelling, but uh, if you really put those on, you can even get relief from the noise of the show here. <laughs> <laughs> wow, can I take them away now? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah sorry, I, I can't give you those. It's just the first day of the show, but... <laughs> <laughs> well, they certainly look very cool. So these are designed for general purpose studio use. Exactly, yeah. For all the processes where there is an open microphone, it's perfect because they are closed back, isolate very good. Um, so for monitoring, mixing, they are perfect. Um, we have a detachable cable. Uh, by the way, those uh, retail for uh, 299 so at a very competitive price, based on the fact that they are made in Austria. So they are really made in Vienna. It's uh, not one of those uh, copycats that are out on the market. <laughs> um, what I just want to mention before we run into a too long talk, I tend to do that, sorry about that, but I'm excited about my products, uh, is that we have designed a whole new earpad for those products. And the nice thing is they have a very soft foam, but also we have had this new earpad design where we basically can fold your ear into the pad so we have more room for your ear on a smaller outer diameter because people tend to pack these headphones away. You can fold them flat, you can uh, fold them inwards, so whatever fits your backpack best, um, but still they have enough room for your ear. Amazing. So are these going to be available now? Um, we are shipping as we speak, so they shall arrive in the stores in Feb. Wonderful. Well, can't wait to try them. Thank yeah. you, Philip. And by the way, um, as we're talking about folding into your ear, for those people who like the on-ear models, we also bring out the Hi X50. Uh, that's an on-ear model with basically the same uh, acoustic properties, but in an on-ear design that sits on your ear, uh, and they are available in April. And they will be the same price? Uh, we try to bring them to 249 um, Should be a bit more aggressive there. Wonderful. Well, I can't wait to try them out. Thanks very much for your explanation, Philip. Really nice to meet you. Thank you.